on July 5th, 1970. Air Canada Flight 621 left Montreal, Quebec with 100 passengers and nine crew members on board. The flight was en route to Los Angeles, California with a stopover at Pearson International Airport. Uh, as the airplane approached the airport, the right wing struck the ground during its descent. The pilot was able to pull up to 3,000 feet and fly north away from the airport. The engines on the wing exploded, the right wing fell away, the airplane crashed to the ground in this former farm field. And sadly, all 109 lives were lost. Hey everybody, welcome back. Today, we are at that crash site and I don't know if there are any spirits attached to this place, but it has intrigued me ever since I learned about it and I am here today. Do a little bit of ghost tube. Uh, hopefully the rain holds off and we can get a little bit in anyway. But, uh, yeah, it's a... Uh, interesting place again found on my searches for local cemeteries and I had never knew this story until doing some digging on local cemeteries anyway let's get some ghost tube happening let's see if there are any spirits here attached to this site and uh, I don't know we'll just see what we get zero ex expectations but uh, that's how I like to roll. Anyway, let's check this crash site out and uh, see if anybody's still here. Okay, let's get some ghost tube happening. And this will be a short one. Like I said, I, I have zero expectations here. But you never know with these, right? I'll make sure. That's on. Try a good old regular ghost tube first. Get the volume up. And I've got that camera watching me. So if I stand here, then over here, I'll put the, uh, the ghost tube view. I'll actually turn and that's all the memorials at the crash site here it's now a park and oh there's a red tail hawk hunting over the field that was kind of neat Nothing immediately on a ghost tube. But like I said, I, I don't have any expectations. It's just a spot that's intrigued me. Please listen. I'm listening. Do you have something you'd like to tell me? I'm here to listen if you'd like to talk. If I happen to get any names during this investigation, I'll have to do a quick search. I'm sure there's a list of names somewhere. I would be very curious. If I get any names, I'll look it up and I'll 
definitely say on screen whether or not that name is associated with this place. December. It's about five degrees today, which is actually pretty warm for December. Aroused. Aroused. That's a weird word for this site. that time of year. Mm. Nothing at a ghost tube. Try, I can't record through it, but let's uh, Get spirit talker happening. Um. Go away. Go away. Do you really want me to go away? I'm just here to communicate with you. I just wanna wanna chat if you happen to still be here. Lucy. Lucy. Okay. I will look up Lucy. If I find anything for Lucy, I'll throw some text up on the screen. It's a name, at least. Maybe it means something. Maybe it means nothing. Incredibly quiet here so far, though. close all those out and uh, let's get some ghost tube seer happening see what that uh, that does it's been interesting lately so we will I'm gonna set up the camera on a rock there overlooking the entire site and then I will try seer and see what happens let's do it and let's record through seer Really curious to see what happens with Seer here. If anything. It's entirely possible that nothing will happen. Everything else has been quiet so far.
Wow. I can't believe how quiet everything is here. I don't know if any of the bodies were left here or if they were moved. Oh, here we go. Here's an image. A white rabbit in a forest. Interesting. Very interesting. Love to get your interpretations of that in the comments below. Uh, the white rabbit at the edge of the forest. Or the edge of a forest doesn't. Or maybe it's in reference to some wildlife that happened to get killed in the uh, in the plane crash as well. Maybe I don't know. Could have other interpretations. Please let me know yours in the comments below. Given the location that we're standing at, I'm really curious to see what ideas some of you might have. You all have some very interesting ideas uh, when it comes to the seer images sometimes. That's, that's why I like to share them. It's interesting to see what everybody comes up with. Still incredibly quiet here though. Can't get over how quiet it is. Okay. I'm uh, not getting anything here. So I think it's just going to be a super quick one. But like I said, interesting sight. We'll uh, we'll close out this video. Let's go. Before I close out the video, I did find a plaque that's got the names. And there's no Lucy, as far as I can tell. I did not see Lucy. We'll check again. But I did see a Luke. And if the app is finding the closest to then maybe Lucy is Luke Luke de Care and Mark de Care well actually there are a lot of members of the de Care family on board this flight like I said short video for this week um, I didn't really have any expectations coming to this place. And this has basically confirmed my suspicions. Maybe I'll come back in July, uh, close to the anniversary of the crash. Maybe it'll be a little more active then, but I really don't know. But, uh, I just like checking out these places, and they're not always going to be most haunted locations. They're not always going to be haunted, period, locations. But as an investigator, you should check out everywhere. Investigate everywhere, not just where everybody else is going. So with that said, please like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. That way you know these videos are going live. And we will continue our search for something, anything. Let's find something.